got an RCA jack that has a piece broke off down in it. The nail piece broke off down in it. Basically, it snapped off. My little boy uh, stepped on it and broke that nail piece off. And I gotta figure out how to get it out. So I saw something on the YouTubes that I want to check out. Basically, a person used a nail and then like uh, kind of hooked the end a little bit so that the nail is nice and straight right now. Basically, they hooked the end a little bit. I think this will work for it. I don't need to hook it much. It just needs to be enough to kind of grab that thing. I don't want to cut the thing totally in true into. But it's got a little bit of hook. Let's see if I can hook that a little bit. Oop, almost too much. It's got a little bit of a barb on it now, right here. So just a little bit of a barb right there. Now that I kind of squish that down. And the secret sauce is the center of those RCA adapters are plastic. What they basically did was use the hook part on here heated it up and then stuck this hook part down into the center part of the uh, male part of the RCA adapter which is plastic so it melted into it you leave it sitting there for a few seconds and then once the plastic melts back around it you got that little hook part holding on to it and uh, you can pull it right out supposedly let's see how it works that should be hot enough Ooh, that's nice and steamy all right the catch is you got to get it without touching any of the rest of the stuff. Ooh, yep, I'm melting the plastic part. Not cool. It's exactly what I don't want to do. So I'm melting the surrounding part of it. Not cool. Hopefully, it grabbed it enough. We'll see. A couple more seconds and I'll try to pull it out. <laughs> Patience while the plastic cools. Let's get a little more light just in case we need that. Is that too much light? Never too much light. Let's try this jump. What the heck? How awesome that worked. That worked way better than I expected. So the metal part's right here, and then the plastic part uh, is right there, and it was just able to uh, melt down in there and grab the hold. That's impressive. YouTube solved that problem for me.